One of the exciting things that's happening in medicine today, especially in cancer, is this development of trying to individualize your treatment. So the candidates for precision medicine or personalized medicine, there are many, but most of us direct this new type of technology to the advanced patients. I was diagnosed with prostate cancer in 2002, and we went on being treated again by my urologist until uh, 2007. I went to see a uh, oncologist at the institution I was working at, and he didn't know of any other treatment, and he gave me a referral to Carmenos, and I had an appointment with an oncologist here. I arrived, it was Dr. Heath. She was always very positive about what the next treatment was going to be. One of the concerns we have is for people with advancing disease, we need more options. So one of the ways that we're trying to get that and to understand how to better treat that patient is to develop precision type medicine or individual medicine because our approach is to really understand the patient and the tumor and how best to kill it. So what happens is when the patient is biopsied, a portion of the biopsy or the portion of the tissue will go to pathology for diagnosis. Another portion goes to Keras molecular intelligence testing, which identifies different genetic alterations in the patient's tissue. Another portion will come here to our lab and we'll grow this tissue as organoids outside the patient's body. So we can use these organoids as an experiment to see which treatment might work best for the patient without using the patient as an actual experiment. So many places can send out for these types of tests. What does my cancer look like? How did it respond? Is this the right therapy? Information in itself is never enough. How do you apply that information and then know what happens to the person? Was it good? Was it bad? Can we do better? That is one of the things we do really well here at Kermanos because we're all about team science. I had a uh, bone biopsy uh, and also uh, a collection of cells that they could then clone and see what genetic background was going on. And now at this point, um, they have taken the biopsies and from the cloning of these cells, they can develop a personalized treatment specifically for the type of cancer I have. I think the Kermanis team and the research staff they're all dedicated. We have one main mission for these patients. How do I help them? How do I help them live longer? How do I help them have a better quality of life? And what is the best way to do that in the most efficient and cost-effective manner? My first comment to most of the people who I have spoken to, do not pass goal. Do not collect your $200. Go straight to Carmanos. They have the knowledge, the experience, the technology to treat your cancer the best. There are always hope that this technology will move on in the earlier stages of cancer, but that same technology has to be honed and better understood. And now we have this opportunity to let patients be involved in that by having them contribute their own tumor to this cause.